In this teaching video, we will present the steps needed to take a chest X-ray in a mobile setting. This demonstration uses the portable Amadeo P100 20HB X-ray unit. First, the equipment required includes generator, mobile X-ray machine, X-ray tube stand, chest stand, computer system, Imaging plate, lead apron, lead shield, optically stimulated luminescence dosimeter OSLD. Before taking a chest x ray, make sure the lead shields used in the mobile x ray room effectively protect against radiation leakage. Also, cover the detector with an easy-to-clean plastic sheet to reduce the risk of infection from one patient to another. Then, 1. Turn on the generator. 2. Turn on the stabilizer. 3. Turn on the tube. 4. Turn on the detector. 5. Turn on the computer. 6. Turn on the imaging software. 7. Check that the detector is connected to the computer. Eight. Lastly, test the machine in advance to ensure it is working properly. Once the patient enters the test room, review the patient request form and ensure the information is correct by counterchecking it with the patient. If the patient is female, ask if she is pregnant or could be pregnant. In case of pregnancy, inform the patient that to avoid exposing the fetus to radiation, she cannot have the x-ray taken, and notify the team leader. If there are no concerns around the patient's exposure to radiation from a chest x-ray, describe the procedure to the patient in simple, easy-to-understand terms. We're planning to take a chest x-ray today because the doctor referred you for one. To prepare for the chest x-ray, you will change into the gown we provide you and remove any jewelry like a necklace. During the procedure, you'll do an easy breathing exercise. Inhale deeply when we tell you to and hold your breath. We'll tell you when you can exhale and then breathe regularly. This will expand your lungs so that we can get a clear picture of everything and for correct diagnosis. Thank you for your cooperation. Ask the patient to change into a hospital gown. Insert the patient's ID number, name, and age into the imaging software and select the requested procedure. In the room where the mobile radiography will occur, Place the tube at the recommended source-to-image distance of 72 inches. Alternatively, keep the distance between the tube and the detector at arm's length. Adjust the tube and detector until they are centered. Steps for chest x-ray patient positioning. 1. To take a chest x-ray in the posterior anterior position, have the patient stand upright with their chest against the image receptor, IR plate. Ask the patient to spread their feet slightly to evenly distribute their weight. Check that the upper border of the IR is approximately two inches above the patient's shoulder. Have the patient raise their chin to prevent superimposing lung apices. Position the central ray, CR, at the inferior border of the scapula, that is, T7 level. Check that the alignment of the CR and IR are centered. Place both of the patient's hands on their hips and have their elbows bend forward toward the IR as much as possible. Place the right or left marker on the right or left upper corner of the IR. Collimate the four sides of the lung fields. Ask the patient to not move. Go to the control panel to take the X-ray. Two. To take a chest x-ray in the anterior posterior AP position, have the patient stand upright with their back against the IR plate. Ask the patient to spread their feet slightly to evenly distribute their weight. Check that the upper border of the IR is approximately two inches above the patient's shoulder. 
Have the patient raise their chin to prevent superimposing lung apices. Position the CR at the nipple line. Check that the alignment of the CR and IR are centered. Place both of the patient's hands on their hips and have their elbows bend back toward the IR as much as possible. Place the right or left marker in the lit upper corner of the IR. Collimate the four sides of the lung fields. Ask the patient to not move. Go to the control panel to take the x-ray. 3. To take a chest x-ray in the lateral position, have the patient stand upright with their left side against the IR plate. Ask the patient to spread their feet slightly to evenly distribute their weight. Check that the upper border of the IR is approximately 2 inches above the patient's shoulder. Have the patient raise their chin to prevent superimposing lung apices. Position the CR at the nipple line. Check that the alignment of the CR and IR are centered. Ask the patient to raise their arms and rest their hands on their head. Place the right or left marker on the lit upper corner of the IR. Collimate the four sides of the lung fields. Ask the patient to not move. Go to the control panel to take the x-ray. 4. To take a chest x-ray in the AP lordotic position, have the patient stand upright with their back against the IR plate. Ask the patient to take one step forward. Then have them lean back and rest their shoulders, neck, and back of the head against the IR plate. Check that the upper border of the IR is approximately 3 inches above the patient's shoulder. Have the patient raise their chin to prevent superimposing lung apices. Direct the CR at 15 to 20 degrees cephalic angulation from the nipple line. Position the CR at the nipple line. Check that the alignment of CR and IR are centered. Place both of the patient's hands on their hips and have their elbows bend back toward the IR as much as possible. Place the right or left marker in the lit upper corner of the IR. Collimate the four sides of the lung fields. Ask the patient to not move. Go to the control panel to take the x-ray. Breathe in regularly. Regular exhalation. All right, inhale deeply and hold your breath for a moment. Now you can exhale and breathe normally. To prevent infection, Clean the cover sheet on the detector with 70% alcohol after each patient. Check image quality in the imaging software. After all operations, shut down the computer system and generator. Gently clean the x-ray tube, tube stand, and chest stand using an alcohol swab. Pack up all equipment and clean the floor with disinfectant. Wash your hands thoroughly. By following the above procedures, you can take chest x-rays appropriately and systematically.